Fat AJ Post Show video for a Monday. It is the 4th of January 2016. That's my forced back to work smile. Oh, I know it's hard. It's tough. For Let's me, back, it's, it's like back to work nap. I'm are you so tired? tired. I'm so tired. I know you are. I'm so tired. Even if you're tired, go to the gym or, or take a walk or something. With the new year comes many New Year's resolutions. One of the most popular, obviously, is to get into shape, lose weight, get fit, whatever. I think it may we all be. just feel bloated after the holidays. You do, and I feel bloated. I'm not gonna lie, and I I ran through the holidays too, and I still feel bloated. But New Year's resolutions also serve as like the kick in the butt. Like yeah. you know, throughout the year, you say, "Oh, I should quit smoking. Oh, I should do this. Oh, I new should do that." New year, new you. There you go. But you know, unfortunately, with those New Year's resolutions um, comes something. It's very dreaded. It is the gym rats who make fun of the people who have now joined a gym. That you know who so you are. Mean. Why would you ever begrudge anybody for doing something good for themselves? Why? I have because they took up like that extra locker space. That's in... what it is. Oh, people get Give so. Me a I mean, look. I mean, I even know it now. Um, in the gym I go to. I know people that have routines. And when because he did. He joined his gym yeah. last year at this time. I and he's did. he's still part of it. Which oh, is it was so intimidating, too. When I walked in there on January, not that it's intimidating like where I go or the people or whatever, but it was just, I'm like, oh, I am that dude. I'm that dude walking in on January going, what? I want to get in shape. Uh, sign me up. What do they call them? Uh, people who just go to the gym uh, for a few uh, months? Okay, this is... Like a, starting in January? This is a term that was coined by one of my friends who's a personal trainer. Trainer, so she probably gives personal trainers well, a bad name. Shame on her. She calls them resolusers. New That's Year's mean. resolusers because she says obviously they'll be going out of the gym fast. So what? You know what? I say nothing wrong. Try the gym. If the gym doesn't work out for you, do something else. I hate gyms. I've been a member of several gyms. I hate them, which is why I run. But you should never ever begrudge somebody for trying to make themselves better, even if it's only for a few months. So listen, all you gym rats who incessantly post online how you're at the gym. Oh my God, these people are taking up my locker space. They're not going to be here in a month anyway. <sighs> Stop. We get it. Be ha get and that's fine. If, if going to the gym is what makes you happy. That's your escape. That's fine. Someone's messing up your cheese. But don't hate on somebody else for going. Maybe be helpful. Tell them which classes to take. You know what? That'd be great because maybe you see someone struggling. They're new. They're kind of looking around. Eyes wide open. Maybe go, hey, what are you looking to do? Don't, hey, don't, don't do the machine like this. Do it like that. Be exactly. helpful. Be proactive. Be not proactive. Mean. Come on now. Are you going to go back to the gym now? Yeah. I he should. hasn't been to the gym since like November. I take off the, between Thanksgiving and Christmas. When the when his gym fees came out in the middle of December, I looked at him and I said, did we just pay for you not to go to the gym this month? Listen, <laughs> Jenny Boone has been paying not to go to the gym for over two years. <laughs> I got nothing on her. Love each other and everyone get on a treadmill. Yeah. All right. Hey, um, thanks for watching. Click on the button below if you want to become one of the many people who subscribe to the Cars 108 YouTube channel. And we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye-bye.